Hey everyone, Tech Elementary with a video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to add your own custom emojis on your iPhone on iOS 18. So if you ever went to your iPhone's keyboard and was trying to find an emoji to match something and you couldn't because it wasn't available, you couldn't use it. Now you can actually create your own emoji from a photo that you took. So you can go ahead and download a photo from the internet, right? Or you can take one that you have on your library already so I have one here I'm going to use this and create an emoji of this cat picture so in order to do that all you're going to want to do is go ahead and open up your keyboard anywhere I'm going to use messages as an example and then all you're going to do is go ahead and tap on the emoji icon here and then where it says sticker all the way to this page right right after the emoji it says open sticker so I'm going to go click on open sticker and then I'm going to go ahead and create a sticker basically so right here where you have that no stickers are created so this icon I'm going to click on new sticker and then I'm going to find a picture that I want to create a sticker from so let's go ahead and find that photo here so I have this one as you can see here it highlighted that already knows that could be a sticker so I'm going to add that as a sticker and then when I do that you know, select it right but if I go back here let's go to the keyboard here right here as you can see here with this update now I have this as a emoji just like that and I can keep on using it just like any other emoji just like that I guess then that you can see here and it will always be available there for me you don't have to keep on adding it if I go ahead and open it up again right let's go ahead and tap emoji right here it's part of my emoji library right now you know pretty cool update on iOS 18 if you want to go ahead and do that Check that out, and I hope this video is helpful. If so, please consider the like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for your iPhone and other iOS devices. We'll see you guys next time.